Hey guys, what's up? Strawberry Ice here. Here's my two cents. As you may or may not know, I'm based here in Cincinnati, Ohio, on the west side. Big Bearcat fan. So I want to give a shout out to my Bearcats. They're playing Tulsa tonight on ESPN2. Make sure you check it out. Should be a good game. Tulsa took us to overtime last time. I think the Bearcats got it tonight. In the association last night, James freaking Harden. Now when you're on a streak like he is, your middle name's freaking. Last night at the Gardens versus the Knicks, scored 36 points in one half. That's a rocket record for a half. Finished the game up with 61 points at Madison Square Gardens. That ties a record for a visiting player there. Tied some guy named Kobe. I think you might have heard of him. Yeah, Kobe Bryant, the Black Mamba. Yeah, he's pretty good. His 61 points gave him 21 games, consecutive games, with 30 or more points. That's ridiculous. That's the fourth longest streak in NBA history. Tying the great Wilt the Stilt Chamberlain. You know, the guy who scored 100 points. He is in high water right now for James Harden. This is one other just next-gen ridiculous stat. In this streak, he's had 76 field goals made without an assist. 76 made field goals without an assist, meaning that nobody's passed him the ball. He's either taking you off the bounce, did his little double step back, which is a travel, but they're letting him get away with it, or his behind the back, whatever it is. He's got open and he's made the shots. James, you are ridiculous. It's been fun watching you. Keep it up. All right, bad news. Last night, Victor Oladipo of the Indianapolis Pacers went down last night with a knee injury, which stinks for him and the Pacers because, as like I said, Pacers, everybody was sleeping on them. They're a good team. Everybody's talking about Toronto, Boston in the East. I was like, hey, Pacers are no joke. But now, unfortunately, it looks like Victor's season is over. Wait till next year. Sorry, Pacers fans. All right, now moving on to LT Gray. Tiger freaking Woods. Probably the greatest sports comeback in history. Two years ago, he could barely move and play with his kids because back hurts so bad. Trust me, I've had back problems. Sometimes my back goes up, I just want to sit in a chair, and that even hurts. Two years ago, he had spinal fusion surgery. Now, I don't think you're supposed to be able to go out and swing a golf club like Tiger Woods can, but he is Tiger Woods, so... Who can't swing a golf club like him? But after spinal fusion surgery, that's ridiculous. Last year, came back, won his first tournament, jumped a ton of points into the standings of the greatest golfers ever. This weekend, he opens up in the Farmers Insurance Open. Check your local listings. Check out LT Gray. It's going to be good. All right, that's my two cents. Make sure you like and subscribe. Other than that, that's just sports, baby. Take it easy, guys.